to the stage. Please give a warm welcome to Elon Elson Schwab. Right? She's like, I'm not going to do that. That's not my responsibility. 
I was like, it's not my responsibility to go into your room and you're not wearing your underwear and perfume, but I do it. <laughs> I like that song. I was just getting ready to go to a party the other day, the bathroom door was open, just putting our stuff on. I was like, dang, man, you look hot. I'd do you. She's like, come on, that's gross. So I cleared up. And I was like, oh, no, no, I mean, like a brother. You know? <laughs> that she didn't know. <laughs> I like the times that my neighbors do that and go down and like ask for like really complicated stuff, you know, not just like an egg. I like to be like, hey, can I get a smidgen of beef stroganoff? <laughs> trouble you for some homemade chicken soup, please. <laughs> that would be swell. Thank you so much. I'm not opposed to text messaging like you guys are. I can tell by the looking at you all. I think it can be really useful if you can make short pieces of information in a timely fashion, such as if you're running late, you can be like, hey, I'm going to be 10 minutes late. Or if you want to mix it up, you can be like, hey, I fucked your mother last night. It was awesome. I'm going to be 10 minutes late. I got a friend, and he'll write me things like this. I've not seen me in three months. I'm like, what's going on? And I'm like, I can answer that with anything from not much to my girlfriend's denying me sex again to we bombed the shit out of Germany until they surrendered. Hooray, <laughs> let's celebrate you buy the condoms and open up my sailor suit. That's right, Hitler, you're a little bitch. And tonight I'm gonna get some hot guy and guy action that I never knew I wanted. All this little text message, you guys feel me or what? That's all right. I was complaining to my friend the other day. I was like, I'm never gonna get a job that pays me more. And he's like, dude, never say never. And I was like, Fuck you, you just said that shit twice. <laughs> I hate that expression. <laughs> Whatever you said, I'm joking. No, that's why. How about never say baby fucker? <laughs> I can't imagine any situation where you have to use that phrase. You're at a party, some guy's acting like a total douche. Friends like, guy's such a. Baby fucker, he likes to put his dick in babies. Dude, never say baby fucker. 